Hey, what's going on guys? This is the King Hunter, another episode of Slugter Slug It Out 2, and today's spotlight is gonna be Frostfang. Let's take a look to Frostfang. Frostfang uses its mirror shard power to create an ice shield in front of the player while also freezing their tiles. Hmm, okay, it's a little bit worse than Frostfang in Slug Tears Slug It Out 1 <laughs> because in that one we didn't have any side effect, but in this one apparently our tiles are gonna get froze. Okay, before we start with this episode, let's go and say hi to the Slugglinger of this episode we have Bookie. if the ghost is inside the canister i would love to see the canisters turns red that would be way more cool Do you know what that is an awesome comment i'm gonna tell that to the developers that is a nice detail it would be awesome if the canister actually turns red if the ghoul is inside i like it Bookie, amazing i love it and the combination that we're gonna use in this episode is coming from norgi printing do gundog tenisher boondog and frost Thing. Let's see, do we have everybody? Oh, okay, what's going on here? Where's the ball? Okay, the ball is right there. Goodbye, guys. So we got Tennis Shirt, we got a Goon Dog, we got Boon Dog, and also we got Frost Fang. It is going to be interesting. Mm, trying to see what is the combination or what is the combo. Uh, Tennis Shirt, Boon Dog, uh, okay, I don't know. <laughs> but we're going to figure out this together. You guys are ready? Let's go to the arena. All right, all right, all right. Goon Dog, Tennis Shirt, Boon Dog, and Frost Fang. Let's see what we can do. The Grime City. Slug it out. Okay. Uh, right away, you guys know, we need to get ready with Tenisher. Tenisher is going to be the only charger in this combination. And uh, it's not going to be easy. Absolutely not. Frost Fang is right there waiting for us to start delivering the uh, interesting blow. Let's see. Oh, hold on a second. That's that's way too much. No, 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 no. That's why we have Tenisher. So we can start charging our slugs. Tennis is ready to go. Let's have Frostman. Frostman is the only one that I have level three. What? Okay, we got <laughs> that didn't work out very well. That was a good protection because of uh oh perfect. We can send this one. Because the, my opponent is using oh, for how long my tiles are frozen? Can I Hello? What? Is during the whole game? No, oh, no, they, they're getting, they, okay, they're melting little by little, but that's gonna take a while. Okay, then I share, go for the win, my friend. Wow, what do we need to do to unfreeze this stuff? This is not looking good at all, let's send Gundog. We're gonna send Boondog in a few more seconds. Boondog is almost ready. My tiles are still frozen. Uh, what do we need to do? We need to make some, ah, uh, maybe we need to match tiles close to the frozen one. Is that, is, is that what we have to do? Is it it? Uh, I, I can't move. Now I can't move at all. Come on. Really? Wow, that's super challenging. Frostbank, let's go. I don't know if I want to use from. I need to do combinations. That's Apparently, that's the only way I have to start getting uh, to uh, melt my slugs. Oh, those tiles. I'm sorry. I'm just getting confused. This is so, so, so crazy. This is the first time ever that I come across a gold that is that powerful and that dangerous at the same time. Let's see, Frostfang, let's go. I don't even know, do I wanna send Frostfang? Do I really wanna send Frostfang? Probably not. Probably this is the last time we're gonna use Frostfang. It's so challenging. It's so difficult. What are we supposed to do in here? We got Tenisha in position. Can we get Tenisha level two? Yes, it was probably too late. I didn't have enough time to start getting ready to send my troops. Tenisha, go. Now we need you, my friend. Now I need you more than anybody and ever because things are looking super difficult. And here goes Frostfang. <laughs> this is so challenging. Okay. All right, not too bad. We got Gundog in there. Gundog can help me big time. Excellent, excellent. It's gonna take me forever to finish my opponent because I can't even move my poor tiles. Oh, this is not good. Well, we need to send Tenisher just to be able to counter Ramstorm. Do we counter that? Yeah, excellent. We can send this. We get encounter again. We can send Boondock. Can we send Bo oh, oh, everything is frozen in here. Everything is frozen. I can't even move now. Oh, excellent. Okay, that's good. That is the only good part about Frostband so far. He's doing some decent damage. And he's helping me to at least finish my opponent. Wow, this is this is definitely one of the most difficult ghouls ever. 
like ever ever what do you think about it let me know in the comment section below because until now i'm struggling so much trying to get frostbang going wow okay i really want to finish this battle using frostbang i'm not really sure we're gonna be able to do that yeah i don't think so well i'm doing my best i'm doing my best to get frostbang ready for action i cannot believe that he's holding my tile for so long i just cannot believe that's below that's beyond my mind i cannot understand that it's so crazy powerful the side effect do we really want to do that I, I don't think so okay let's go wow we get encounter big time that is not good guys we are in trouble now we are in trouble i don't want to send frost i'm going to use tennisher just to break the ice can we destroy the wall no i didn't have enough to destroy the wall that is not good all right we need to do something about it guys Things are looking more, more, more complicated for us. Uh, oof. I'm gonna let that pass. I'm gonna need to let that pass. And we need to get Tenasher in position or we won't be able to do much. There you go, Gundok. Go take care of business. Now we can send probably Frostfang one more time. Which again is becoming one of the most crazy ghouls in the history of the crazy ghouls. Like I ever. <laughs> okay, Gundog is almost ready. Let's see how can we get Gundog in position. Can we have Gundog? Okay, actually we're almost ready to go in this one and finish this battle. I think we're ready to go. Okay, what we're gonna do, we're gonna finish this like the champs. We're gonna send everything in one go. Okay, Frostbang, are you ready? Hopefully you are. Because we're going. We are going really hard now. There's no, nobody's gonna stop us. There is no way somebody's gonna stop us. Uh, I hope so. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Let's go with everything. Frostbound at the end. And that will do it. Victory is ours. That was so difficult. That was so difficult. I cannot believe that Frostbound is so, so, so difficult. What? You know what? What we have to do, we're gonna open a couple of these golden boxes because we need to start upgrading our ghouls otherwise we're gonna struggle a lot in the game wow that was super super challenging let's go and open a couple probably a uh, five or ten of the gold boxes at the store perfect let's go over here uh let's use the power up chest this is a question somebody told me to please make an episode and open a couple of these power up chests see Awesome rewards initially inside, purchase chest immediately, uh, 450, 600 food, 100 and 1,000 coins, um, 10 to 50 gems. So let's open the first one. Okay, okay, okay. What do we got? 21. Goondog, awesome, awesome. We need to get our ghouls up to level 10 at least. Perfect. Wow, that's a lot of food. Oh, these, po these power boxes are so OP. They have everything. Look at that. So many gems. Negashay getting some food. Infernus helping me. Probably go to level 18. Boondog is moving to 19. Gr Guys, these boxes are the best. I cannot believe it. Okay, we almost, let's go for the third one. We're going to open this. Get some more gems. They're urchin. That's the character we have to use. If you want me to use your combination in the future episode, post in the commentary section below. And guys, don't forget to give it a like to the video. Okay, that is super important so people can see that you guys are enjoying this series and I can continue making Slug Terra videos. Infer wow, Inferno is getting a lot of love. This is a lot of love for Inferno. <sighs> you know what we're going to do in a future episode? Vampire, nice. What we're going to do in a future episode? I got an idea. We're going to open some of these power up boxes okay and depending which slug we're gonna get is the slugs that we're gonna use in the game and in that episode that is a great idea okay that is exactly what we're gonna do in a future episode amperling Ooh, maybe you're gonna be the next spotlight ghoul of the game okay perfect after scroll let's open one more that is a great idea i love that idea we're gonna get some random teams get some cheat tussling fragist Gundog getting some love. Excellent. Oh, Gundog is ready to move to level 10. Where is Gundog? All right, let's go with Gundog. Gundog, one level, two levels, three levels. Oh, man, this is so powerful. 12, 13. Wow, that is an amazing antenna shot. Also can move one level, two levels, moving to level 16. Guys, we have so much stuff to do. Please let me know which one is going to be the spotlight goal of the next episode. Slug Terror, slide it out. This is the Game Hunter. Don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, and also don't forget to share my videos. I will see you in the next one. Take care, everybody. Bye.